Our investigation in 2011 tracked millions of dollars in welfare benefits from Kansas and Missouri and found taxpayer cash spent in all 50 states, including Hawaii, casinos on the Vegas Strip, and family theme parks in Florida. Today at the Capitol, Missouri State Auditor Tom Schweik released his findings on the massive government program for needy families. And yes, he found examples like one Missouri recipient spending your tax dollars in the Virgin Islands. Those are the examples that people get mad about, but in reality, how often is this happening? We identified about $700,000 in highly questionable transactions. That's actually a small percentage of the total in one year. But new federal and state laws are trying to make it tougher for people to use the benefits on things like cigarettes, gambling, and booze. As long as you're able to withdraw cash, can you ever really track all this or prevent all this? That's a good point. If you go into a casino and cash the money, it looks like you're not benefiting the children. On the other hand, you can go to the bank next door and then walk over to the casino. There's no way to track that. Schweik says the Department of Social Services is in the process of updating its technology to more frequently track your tax dollars and catch red flags. This generates taxpayer outrage, but what is the takeaway moving forward from this? The takeaway is that there was a problem. It was a relatively small percentage of the total. Uh, there are new processes and procedures in place to identify a problem. And uh, there's a commitment by the Department of Social Services to follow up and terminate the benefits of those people who are abusing the system. I'm investigator Ryan Kath, 41 Action News.